Welcome everybody, Don't Starve Adventures, the new season. Instantly get some pig friends right here. No, no, I'll take this. Oh, wow. Oh, it's right. I forgot. I'm a spider. Yes. So welcome back. Uh, I am a spider. I am Weber. We found Weber on the last playthrough and I figured, you know what? Instead of w jumping into w WX78, let's give the spider a go. I mean, why not? It's completely different play style, right? I wouldn't really know because I never played it. This guy's really mad. <laughs> I never actually played as Weber. So I'm actually very curious to see where this, where we go with this particular season. Weber's season. What, can I go back now? Because <laughs> there's probably lots of resources since that's the starting area. Of course, they put a pig right at the beginning just to remind you, just to show you who's boss. I can, it looks like I can actually plant uh, spider eggs and obviously immediately befriend them and also release them on the, onto this pig that's harassing me. Right down here, right in the center. This is, this is my home now. How do I probably plant this thing? Plant. Right here. Bam. Alright, where are you at, pig? Let's do this, I'm ready, let's do this, let's do this. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, yes. Come on, come on. Come on. Rock your ass over here, let's go. There we go. Punch the gun, there we go, yes. This is excellent because I might actually be able to score some easy silk right off the bat. Either easy silk or some meat. Yep. I'm gonna pick it up, 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 pick it up. Pick it up. I'll pick it up. Oh, wrong button. A little out of practice. It's been a few days. Come on. Here we go. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. This is perfect. This is perfect. Can he actually beat two of them? He's juking though, he's juking. Oh, listen, there's that silk I was looking for. There's one. And it's a monster meat. Okay, now we'll finish him off. <laughs> Surely we will, right? <laughs> how, how does this guy have any health left? <laughs> I think he's actually dodging some of these shots here. There we go, pig skin. All right, so it cost me a little bit of health. Fix that right now. We don't need we don't need these. Uh, we don't need the, the the flowers or anything just yet. And actually, let me go ahead and take this, and we'll just eat them right now. Restore a little bit of that health. Not much, but it's something. Eat seeds, or like doing any of that just yet. Just top off the hunger. Okay, so that's gonna be home, I guess. Right here in the middle. Right here in the middle. Well, I don't actually know if it's middle, but right there. Not a whole lot of resources in the immediate vicinity, uh, unless this is the field I'm looking for. Looks like it might be. Yes, it's looking good. All right, excellent. Ah, perfect. Flint. Now we can get busy and start doing some stuff here. But yeah, I am absolutely looking forward to giving Weber a fair shot here. I've always played, almost always, exclusively played Willow. She was my girl. Like, just, just, you know, we've, we've been on so many adventures together. Like, what, hundreds of hours of just Willow. Uh, but you know what? Why not give, why not give somebody else a shot and see what we could do? I mean, like, right there. Like, farming a pig and also my own kind. Simply by encouraging fisticuffs. <laughs> <laughs> and it worked. It worked beautifully. The only restrictions that I see happening is like uh, Weber or not Weber. Um, uh, Beehive. I can't do anything with that yet. Uh, Chester. Chester might be a challenge because Chester cannot get near the spiders. So I have to get creative with that. Start to dim a little. Should just stock up on as much of this grass and everything as I can. Now, I think he has a lower sanity than most. Can I see that stat? Let me see. Yeah, 99. Oh, maybe that's the same. I can't, you know, I actually don't know what the sanity value is 
of uh of other characters. Yeah, there, there was two pieces of flint and then, or three pieces of flint and then it just kind of stopped. We have, we can make a torch or something if we need to. Not having our lighter is going to be a bit of a bummer. Being able to just spontaneously light things on fire. Also, not being able to spontaneously light things on fire involuntarily is actually kind of a plus. Since that was ultimately our demise in the last season. Spoiler alert. <laughs> but I guess you'll have to watch it and see exactly how it happened because... Oh god, because it was just not it was just not a good day. At all. Almost night, almost night, gonna get all this stuff. So we start in autumn. Next is gonna be winter, obviously. Whoever has the ability to grow a beard in like a week or something like very little time he could grow a full beard which provides a significant amount of insulation considering it's just a beard uh similar to wilson but i think he i think uh weber grows actually a little bit faster than wilson does so one of the first things we'll be crafting is going to be his do that but we have to uh, of course go and get find rocks and do all this business all this starting crap all this starting all over crap <laughs> uh i probably should go ahead and swap uh, pick up some there you go probably have to pick up some flowers and go and work on getting ourselves a hat it's a nice little hat snapling yeah pick up all these flowers do a little zigzag in here we're kind of on the edge of this part of the map yet. Yeah, not more flowers. Pick up sticks. Might as well just stock up on everything because we are going to use everything. Especially if it stacks to 40. No berries, okay. Seeds. I'm going to add that's five. One of the game's initial cruel jokes, cruel tests, is when it you craft a torch and you're like, all right, I'm good. Let's go exploring for your first night. And then you light it just a smidge too early. And then you realize it doesn't last the entire night. And it will go out just before the sun rises. And you end up taking... A little bit of damage. Now I'm going to try to ride this out. And hope to God that doesn't go out. <laughs> oh man. And a wormhole. I was really close. I was I was pushing it there for me, even for me. <laughs> so we got six. Lots of very upset bees. Moping around, sleeping on the job. This is a beautiful area. I should just go and bring everything out here. I should leave at least one flower, right? For these guys. They could all share one. 34. Let's get to that 40 stack. You guys are eating soon. Eventually also make pickaxe. Regular axe. Basically all the necessary tools. Be beefal over there, which means they're going to be uh, hostile towards me. Nine. Now you notice he doesn't need the... Well, I guess it doesn't matter because it just basically, I was going to say, he doesn't need to wear the, uh, the garland during the day because the sandy doesn't drop, but it doesn't matter. It's, it, it basically continues to rot at the same pace, regardless whether he's wearing it or not. Oh, we're starting a new stack now. Okay, we've got a few more. This is good. This is a really great field. Wow, holy crap. This is a, this is an awesome point. 
and it's actually not far off from my own starting point, which is perfect. And it's, it's also a dead end, so I know I don't have to explore anymore. Anything beyond this. Well, I should probably complete it, because there might be something in the middle. Make our way over. Grab this flower here. Super close to getting our 12. Let me see. Yeah, we'll go right. Oh, never mind. This is the tiniest little sliver right there. There's nothing in there. All right, we'll go and continue getting grass. Start chopping down these trees too, and obviously replant them because this air. This is definitely going to be the uh, the horn of plenty down here in terms of just general resources. And yeah, like I would love to take every single flower, but I need to make sure there's at least one. At least one. That way we don't have to go and get butterflies from other areas and come back and replant them. The butterflies will continue to spawn and continue the cycle. Oh, here we go. Cool. Plenty of hair. Don't feel bad. Uh, we will not craft it yet, actually. We'll wait until nighttime. Just to conserve. That's an extra half day that we'll have it. Okay, let's see. This area is pretty much clear and this is the wormhole. Let's go ahead and scout up the top here. See what's up here, and then we'll get to chopping trees. This, okay, good. Basically, chop as many trees as we can, get tons of logs, burn through a ton of this flint. There's some rocks there. There's the pickaxe, we'll whip that out. Oops, wrong. There we go. Good. Oop. No, nothing going in the water. There we go, okay. So I usually ditch Nitra, especially early on, but I think I'm going to hold on to it because the summer, which is not for a long time now, the summer, it is invaluable. You know what? There's a nice little pocket of trees. I think I'm going to start hacking, actually hacking all these things down. Yeah, because it looks like there's just a little peninsula here and a tiny little bridge. Huh. This is a very nice place. <laughs> I would like to stay here, please. <laughs> Forever. All right, let's go ahead and grab. Oh, not do it that way. Let's do it this way. Good. Equip. Start chopping as many trees as we can, get lots of wood, eat some things. Might just start a quick fire just to cook some stuff, get topped off. Yes, come on, yes, I don't even have enough room to get, pick that up. Yes, yes, tweet, tweet, uh, uh, uh. Good. Good, well, let's go ahead and cook basically everything. Uh, what do we have, like, one or two of? Well, let's cook this. And then we'll eat it. There you go, freeze up the space, and we'll cook. Oh, I'm on fire. Whoops. <laughs> Come on, can I not be on fire? <laughs> that thing's not that close. Here we go. <laughs> okay, so don't drop anything next to the fire. I didn't realize that the, I thought that only when it's on its highest, like, burn rate, the giant flame. But, oh, that was the moment when it would actually start to hurt. Almost time for bed. They start to light other things on fire. Sandy's starting to go down. Uh, let's go ahead and actually continue to eat. Need to eat, need to eat, and then we will eat. Now we won't eat any more of those. We're good. Let's go and actually grab these. We'll grab these. We'll cook them up real quick. Hang on, near the fire. Keep that sanity in check. Oh, this is not willow. That's not a thing. Let's go ahead and cook these. We'll cook, and then we will eat. Good, nice and topped off. We can go ahead and make our hat now. Perfect. Sanity is still going down, actually, huh? I'm a wee bit surprised. I thought for sure this would be sufficient for her or him. I actually want to keep that flame going too, by the way, because I might come back here and chill for the night. I don't know. We'll see. Can I make a shovel. We could get all these stumps out too. Nah, that was a waste. Waste of everything right now. Flint, etc. Flames going down. We'll feed the logs, not, not anything valuable. Just gonna add fuel. Let's go and pick these up because they'll catch a fire. Good. Let's go ahead and cook these, eat them. Okay, and let's go far away to get a few good trees before the sunsets completely and then we'll come back and get all the ones in the immediate vicinity. 
Maybe I should set up shop in a tiny little, like in a corner, a little tidy little area like that. It might be perfect. Come on, get it down before it breaks. Perfect. Now pick up the stuff before it. Sun goes down. Sun's going down. Perfect. Oh, whatever. Let's see. Food, parasol. Don't need any of that stuff yet. Let's get to hacking. What do we have? 14 log. Just as much, as much, as many of these resources we could get before we depart this place. And I actually wonder, is it possible for me to pick up and relocate the egg? The, uh... Just thinking, just kind of thinking to myself here. So the center hive for the spider den. The spider den can be moved, but I don't believe it will drop. I know it won't drop if it's a tier one, because I've beaten up plenty of tier ones. And they don't drop anything. So I'm guessing tier two or above is when we will actually see it drop. It is entirely possible too that because I dropped it there, I'm not gonna be able to get another one because I need to figure out some way as Weber to actually go and 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 create some kind of whatever mayhem is required in order to get things to fight uh, spiders, like you just saw with the pig, <laughs> with the tan pig. get all these planted then go and get some more good get a farther away here we go get in this corner okay save thank you pick this one up and drop that or plant that as well good gonna walk out of here with more trees than what were there initially. So let's go ahead and actually continue chopping. Is 20 the cap? Yeah, it is 20 is the cap. Okay, cool. So we'll go for two stacks, then we'll get moving. We'll, we'll still burn through it pretty quickly, but there's some, uh, we need to go get some gold and start, like, actually getting some research going. You know what would be really good for Weber? A top hat. Top hats give super strong sanity regen. I think more than a garland. The garland's benefit is that you could just go and make one, right? You could just go find the stuff you need to make one. That's its benefit. Whereas you need silk. Huh. Not quite 13 yet. Let's go. Oh. Gotta be can watch that. That low, low, low count of flint. But that's why we're gonna go to Savannah next and uh, right over there where we saw the uh, the rocks. At least I hope there's more rocks over there. Day three, man. Maybe what we'll do this time is, like, also on top of what we're what we're working on here is, we'll hop into um, adventure mode because all adventure mode does is it does is just puts you through the challenges and then if you fail you go back. It might be kind of a fun diversion for a little bit this season. We'll see. We'll basically just ride this out, see where it goes. Yeah, it sucks. You can't make backup saves. <laughs> I can't like, like let's say if I wanted to. Create like a uh, go and find all the, the all the parts I need to get to to adventure world right the adventure portal. Cause I want to go and get all that stuff and then set it all up so I can start the season and then basically continue the season and just basically restart those start adventures every time I restart from that portal, right? That way it's just a pure like just nothing but adventure portal shenanigans. Which I guess it could be if I get there once, but. I was only get there once and then make a save, and then I have to make another save if I wanted to keep it separate and just use that primary save as okay. This is going to be the one that you use whenever you go into the uh, go into adventure. Oops, let me go actually go back here and plant these guys. Get all these down. Uh, and done. All right, so rocks, rocks. Next, rocks drop flint. We'll find the ones that drop gold. We'll be in good shape. Nitro is good too. Yeah, right up here, right there to the left. As a matter of fact.
How much, uh, I guess I can pick up some more grass. No point in having a partial stack. Especially when it's so abundant. It's everywhere right now. Oh, this whole area is just great. Good. Okay. Might as well pick up some rocks. Beat up these guys over here. Definitely gonna research opulent tools, gold tools. They just provide so much more durability. Just, uh, just obscene amounts of durability. Is that a sinkhole plug? Boy, we've had some pretty bad experiences with that as of late. We should actually go in if there's one. No, actually, we should not. We should probably focus on actually getting some things researched before we do anything silly. Seriously. But I am curious. Maybe we could just take a peek. Just take a gander. Just see what's down there. I mean, the sun's going down anyways. I don't need to sleep. Do you? I mean, you're probably asleep right now, but... I think... We should give it a shot. These guys are going to be hostile towards me. Let's see, we'll just get a quick scan, see what they have over here. Am I covering this right? Yes, I am. Boulder, right? No, this is. Oh, maybe it's not a sinkhole plug thing. It's not. Okay, okay. Well, you guys got lucky, because I was going to do it. No, that it's actually called a sinkhole plug or something, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to cover this peninsula. Get loaded up on resources. Go. Yeah, I'm about to pick up the grass. Because we might, we might torch it. Well, it's not the torch for tonight. Because we continue exploring, gathering things here and there. Actually, you know, I have four logs. I should probably just use that. Make a, uh... Actually... I could pre-prep one. I always forget I could do that. It's kind of the, the, one of the best things about this game. Basically prep. Boop. Just like that. Oh, so something happened. Oh, whoa. Okay, this area is awesome. Okay, yeah, they're not going to let me near it. We will drop this down. Good. That seems to put out enough light for me to stay. It does not. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's do some uh, firefly hopping. Right about there, and then we'll put this down. Whoop, build. There we go. That's gonna set something on fire, maybe. Let's go ahead and get this thing chopped before it catches on fire. All right, so now we know where some uh, some pig guys are, and we have a spider den that is obviously devoid of any spiders. But I could probably upgrade it to <laughs> by using silk again, right? Uh, in order to increase its don't need this increase the number of and number and type of spiders that come from it. That sounds like a plan. I love how you eat monster meat straight up. Which should also make him insane because it's monster meat and he's a monster, but that's fine. Oh, spider glands. Uh, I don't have any ashes. And spider glands will be kind of hard to come by, so I might hold on to that, make a healing salve. I will not eat that yet. It's almost daytime. Where are we at on the map? Oh, it's just a bunch of grass. Hmm. But we'll go down there and take a look anyways. I want to let that fire go. I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, look at that beard. It's already starting. Yeah, let's go and at least, at least cover the area. Are you really coming for me? No, okay. I 
damn, yeah, wow. Waffle. What's this guy's other name? What's this guy's name? Doesn't say. Hmm. Take that monster meat. Come on over here. Ah. Looks like I can, I can attack the damn things. But I'm not going to. Because they're my friends, right? Let's see. Looking at my list at the bottom there. Go ahead and actually pound this meat in a second. <laughs> We're going to throw one log on here just to keep it up for just a minute. Uh, actually, we'll just throw... Uh, no, we won't throw that. We'll throw the one log. There we go. Guess we can go explore. We might come back here. Okay, eat this. Okay, so we're getting back up to that beef flow range up here. Good amount of everything right now. Except, obviously, we could always use more gold. Gonna make a pickaxe. Another one. And then we'll get going. So I have a three silk. Okay, I have no idea what the silk what I could get with the silk here. Um like just like right off the bat, right? Like I know I can't make a awesome hat or anything. I don't think I can. I haven't actually looked. Rocks. Why well, I can't pick those up? Because I have nitra. Yep, I know I said I was gonna keep them. Oh, rain. Nice. Sandy going up while it's raining. Cool. Doesn't give a fuck, obviously. B flow. Alright. So now we're back at that B flow joint. We should. Uh, maybe we could just kind of wrap around and see if there's anything over here. Besides this rock. Get a good glimpse at the next peninsula, peninsula over there. Looks like more delicious resources. I'm gonna start getting hungry soon. Just like thinking ahead, like I don't really have a strategy to get any food other than just what I've picked, what I've picked up off the ground as we've been walking around. I mean, I could fight pigmen, I guess. Does that thing spawn pigmen, that totem area? I don't think so. Not worship zone? Surely not. That'd be weird. This is a big, beautiful field that we will completely avoid come summer because we've already learned our lesson. Look at this touchstone. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. So. 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 We are in a savanna with a touchstone. Where was the last savanna? Remember that? Or where was the last touchstone? It was in a savanna. I said at the end of the last playthrough that I would put resources and supplies there. Now, I'm still going to do that. Because if I die in the summer, I don't want... I do not want to die immediately again in the f fucking s summer like in the, in the savannah just because i don't have resources out there so and this is actually great oh boy yes 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 pig heads where are they at lots of pig heads this is a lot of basically free free pig butt that's it some reed okay i don't want to stray too far here let's cut across actually let's go look for those um i don't know what they're called actually the swamp things. The merman? Merman, probably. I mean, there's one of the things there, but there's a tentacle also, which probably explain his absence. Merm. Merm hut. Probably start coming out of there in a second. Oh, here we go. Ah, they come out at night. That is right. Good. Oof. Well, I guess we're not going through there tonight. Ah, that looks like a sinkhole. And some spider bros. Oh, this is a perfect spot to set up. Oh, they're getting beat up now. Rip spider bros. 
Perfect. Go and pop this open. This is actually probably a really good spot to actually set up shop. Whoops, I didn't necessarily want to go down there, but I guess we're gonna go down there. 